cheese, I have fiber in my eye. Oh, jeez, it's in my eye. Guys, I can actually see this vibe fiber. Mm -mm. I'm gonna stop this video. Wait. Well, after that tiny, tiny book. I'm back to these ginormous books. This is actually an amazing story that shows you. Why don't I just stick with Portuguese? Well, even in Portuguese, uh, I don't know how to read. <laughs> Guys, this fiber is bothering me the best in the whole entire seriously enough of english bye hi everyone welcome back to my channel i'm miss joe and today we're going to read a very special story some of you might not know but last week we celebrated mother's day in portugal and guess what this week we celebrated international mother's day so of course i have to read a book regarding that special day so happy happy mother's day to all you superheroes around you cheeky monkeys just hope you have been a uh, super pampered by your cheeky monkeys and hobbies this is a 24 7 job as you all might know and feel in your uh, body and brain but hey we all love our cheeky monkeys and we can live without them right though sometimes we could if you know what I mean. And let's jump now to the book of the week. <gasps> Superhero Mom. Let's go. <laughs> All moms are truly brilliant, but sometimes you find one who has something special, like my Superhero Mom. She gets up every morning with a superhero leap. Mom! Oh! Though sometimes even superheroes need a bit more sleep. <laughs> she does so many things at once. She zooms around everywhere. Mending, fixing, making. Mmm, yummy! Or taming tangles in my hair. She must have superhero strength because she carries so much stuff. My scooter, wellies, coat, and even that lot's not enough for when we have to run because I see the bus drive by, she picks me up and goes so fast, I think that she can fly. <laughs> she makes up superhero things to do, like this. My favorite game and monster chasing <laughs> children around the playground is its name. If I'm feeling sad or cross or when I've hurt my knee, my mom's the superhero that I always want to see. Ow! <laughs> In a flash and with a smile, my super mom appears with sticky plasters and a kiss to chase away my tears. And when I'm playing in the back, she makes us both look weird by giving each of us a really funny bubble beard. She doesn't wear a cape or fly to Earth from outer space, but she's the one who saves me when there's trouble I must face. Like sometimes when I go to bed, my teddy isn't there and I can sleep without him. So that really is not fair. Where's my bear? My mom's the one who dashes off to have a look around in every nook and corner till... Yippee, hooray, he's found. I say, you are my superhero and the best mom too. She smiles and says, Remember this, my love, because it's true. And then she holds me tight and spins.
brings me in the super world. Every mom the superhero. And so is every girl. <laughs> Hope you like our story, guys. This was such an amazing story and actually shows to all our cheeky monkeys all the nice things we actually do around them. I know, I know, all of you think that your mom is the superhero, but guess what? All moms are actually superheroes. So please pamper and love your mom the whole entire year because it's not just on one day that we should show to her that we love her. So yeah, pamper her now, now, now again, and again, and again. Good job. Well done. Please put your like and subscribe to my channel and comment on my Facebook and Instagram page. What other books could Miss Cho read next? Hmm. Till then, bye!